really cool. They are a set of um, handy helpers. They're a squeegee, a scraper, and a spatula together all in one. Look at that long one, perfect to get down into blenders, to scrape all of your sauces, maybe your hummus, great for food processors. Then you get a medium little squeegee scraper that's great for bowls and pans. And then you get a little small guy, which is awesome for the mayonnaise jar, the mustard jar, get the last of the ketchup out of there. These are wildly popular, they're customer top rated, and the set is less than $20. But there is no reorder, all we have is all we're gonna have for the holiday season. And of course, the brilliant gadget guru, Mark Charles. Have you got time for yet? Is here. No, <laughs> you, you, a lot. you are such a comforting I, I factor bad. for me. No, come on, 1900. <laughs> I That's love his being nickname. with Because uh, we call him MCM in yeah. Roman numerals, it's 1900. Yeah. Just explain it for the newbies <laughs> you out have to there. It to um, all right, so these are silicone, aren't they? Yep, they are silicone. And by the way, what we did just before we start everything, just to show you, it's not just silicone. Okay. It's a metal body we did a clear one so you can understand what's happening oh. the whole thing is is done with a stainless steel piece but we don't put it on the end here and we don't put it on the end here the flexibility mm. of that is what makes it important so this is a clear one you're not going to get this one i just want to prove to you that all of them you think it's just because of the color you're seeing a silicone thing but this is what's happening inside of this it's a metal utensil that's been wrapped in silicone which means it can use be used on any heat Never will melt on you. Will never absorb any odors or any stains. So I could put that in a pot of boiling, boiling water, water. Pasta uh, how water. How about um, uh, boiling oil? Nothing really? will happen to it. Yep. Awesome. But now, why was this made? This is worth the price of admission. The three-piece set, but they made this specifically for blenders. Mm -hmm. There are so many blenders out there, like Vitamixes and such, where the blade is actually in there and doesn't come out. How do you get underneath right there? Well, watch this. This goes in long, and then if you see at the bottom. When I push down, it actually bends. See that? That's awesome. And it bends under the blade. That's a lot where my garlic pieces tend to yep. go. And I love garlic. I want every one. I don't want it stuck in the blender. The bottom so we the love that. So that was made for that piece. Then we did a spatula. We did a smaller version of it because there's so many times where we need a little baby, baby jar. And I don't want to waste the food because we spent good money on it. You can now get into that jar. You can scrape away in that jar all the way to the very bottom and get every last bit of whatever's in there in that jar, all the way at the bottom. Call me crazy, but if that was a bottle of expensive um, anti-aging moisturizer, yes. I'll want that you'll to get want out that every last bit of I was thinking baby food, but moisturizer's okay. good too. <laughs> and then the last piece you're gonna get, remember they're all metal center, but then that flex is on the edge. That Because why? When you wanna use your KitchenAid or your Cuisinart food processors to get in there. Now I did all the onions, watch this just to scrape all the onions off, especially if you're making that great stuffing we talked about, and you, maybe you're doing it with a machine like this. How do you get all the garlic, all the onion, mm -hmm. off there and squeegee it off like that? Isn't that Cause, great? Because that onion is so gold we love that. for a recipe. If, if it wasn't that, then using something, if you're a baker, you want to fold. This is a great folding tool because, the stain, because of the stainless steel, it won't lose its shape, but you can fold for all your desserts in there beautifully and you're not ruining the recipe or the folding technique. Even when you um, try to make homemade um, hamburgers, yep. you don't want to overwork the meat, especially for meatballs, right? Correct. You would know that. Yes, of then course. Because then it would get, uh, it would be a of tough course. meatball. So that would be nice just Again, to fold that Again, just to be together. able to scrape everything this easily. Watch this, look, just, and even the ribbing on the inside of this. Mm. I mean, How satisfying is that? It's really, <laughs> I mean, this is what we call finger licking clean. Like, look at this. I mean, really, nice. I just cleaned that whole thing out it's all in there. That's the difference between using silicone, squeegee, not worrying about heat or anything. Do I have the heat on in this one? Yeah, okay. why don't you check that? Let me Go show ahead. colors because you do have a color choice. We've sold 25,000 sets of these, uh, but once it's gone, it's gone. So you're seeing that beautiful aqua color in all three pieces, the long, the medium, and the small. The other colors we have are the green, gorgeous. We don't see a lot of green in our kitchen utensils here at QVC, so that's cool we have it in that. We also have the purple and red, and then, of course, the black, and it is my most limited, the black color. All right, so now we're cooking again, induction style, right? Again, we did just really induction hot. because it's just easier. Yeah. And again, what I want to prove to you is the heat thing. It got hot fast. We're going to melt this butter. I'm just going to sit this right in there. I mean, look, let's push it right in there. This thing is on. The butter's melting, right? So we know 
This is not gonna melt. This is not gonna melt on you. So this is used for all cookware. It's also not gonna scratch your cookware. Even though that's a stainless steel center, because that's silicone, I'm not gonna scratch it. It's wonderful when you are cooking and making things, mm. whether it's casseroles, but look, I can scrape. Do you see the inside of that? Scrape right in there without any harm to the pan. And it, one thing about omelets, you always have to have the eggs moving if you want mm -hmm. light and fluffy omelets. The true French do it with like chopsticks and they do it very quickly. They do? Yeah, to keep the air in, to keep it really fluffy. And yeah, that's what a French omelet is. Well, I love, I love like, I call it soft scrambled eggs. Yep. You know, it's a little bit wetter, I think. Yeah. So, and you definitely have yeah, to have the movement away. It's going. amazing, it's amazing. So Ooh. use this on anything, whether it is your cookware or getting to the bottom of the jar, you have three quintessential tools that I think are phenomenal and a must have in everybody's kitchen. And you're getting all three for less than 20 when if you walk into a shishi kitchen store, one of these would be like 10 bucks. Yeah, and it's worth the price of admission. Awesome, I love it. Let us know what color you want because there is no reorder. Grab them now, the handy helpers of our set of squeegee scraper and spatula set. Mark Charlie, you want to come with yeah, me? Of course. I I'm going to invite my friends in, the ones that were so brave to be part of my very first